inside this lecture we are going to discuss about position absolute and position relative how we can use these two property together open your coordinator and let's just uh, use this in different way so i'm just going to remove this div from here for right now and let's just insert another div div start div close so here i'm going to use the css inline property the width for this can be something like 100 percent and the height for this can be 400 pixel and the background for this can be something like orange color you can save and preview the page on the browser so you can see this is the setting that we have set it for right now inside this div i'm going to insert another div so it's called the child element or the child div so this is the parent div that we have just set it here and this is the child div that we have set it here uh, let's just use a css inline here style tag just the width for this can be something like 150 pixel and the height for this can be same 150 pixel and the background color for this can be red color save and refresh now we have an orange box with the 100% full width with the height of 400 pixel and we have a red box with 150 by 150 width and height property so inside uh, this red box i mean child div if i just use here the top property for example from the top i want 100 pixel let's just see it is working or not you can save and preview so you can see it is not working after refreshing you can just use the left property also from the left i want just to 1 and 20 px you can save and refresh so again it is not working so what is the reason when you are using two div it means parent div or child div that can be any element that can be heading that can be paragraph so when you are just inserting one element inside another element so this called child and parent element so in this case this is the parent element and this one is the child element so inside parent element you need to set the position to relative and inside the child element you need to set the position position to absolute now you can save go to your browser and refresh now you can see this property is just working just correctly here you can say just from the top you want uh, maybe something like 50 pixel from the left and from the top you want also something like 50 pixel save and refresh so inside this class uh, i want to just make it clear that whenever you are using a parent element and a child element you need to set the position for the parent element to relative and the position for the child element to absolute so this is just the method position for parent element must be relative position relative relative and here you can say just position for child element must be position absolute So I'm just writing this all because maybe there are some beginner student. This can help them to learn better. So anyway, uh, I hope 
this concept is clear for you that uh, inside div element or inside parent element div you can use position relative or inside child element that is the second div you can use position absolute so in next class i will come back so i will tell you about the last property inside this one is called position fixed so till next class it is up to you try to perform a task on position absolute and position relative just watch this video and try to practice have a nice time and see you